It's the magic of math here, and today we're going to compare two rates of change using words and a graph. Here's our question today. We have George and Jenna, who each completed a 12-mile run. This graph shows the total distance in miles that Jenna ran over time. So here's Jenna's run on the graph. Then we have George, who ran at a constant rate of 5 miles per hour. Now we're asked, in the first hour of their run, how many more miles did Jenna run than George ran? And we're going to enter our answer in the box. Here's where you pause the video, do your best work, and then come back to see mine. Good luck. Welcome back. So in the first hour of their run, how many more miles did Jenna run than George ran? So we're going to look at Jenna's run first. Jenna is on the graph, and we want to know in the first hour. So this is in minutes. To do one hour, we need 60 minutes, 60 minutes in an hour. So we're going to go up from 60 and then over to the y-axis, which is our miles. And we can see that in 60 minutes, Jenna ran 6 miles. So we know that in the first hour, Jenna ran six miles. Now we want to talk about George. In words, our problem states that George ran at a constant rate of five miles per hour. That means each hour that he ran, he finished five miles. So we know that George ran five miles in his first hour. In every hour that George ran, he ran five miles. Now we're looking at the question, which says, how many more miles did Jenna run in that first hour? So if Jenna ran six and George ran five, we know that Jenna ran one more mile than George. And there you have it. That is how we compare two rates of change using words and a graph. And that's the magic of math, where we master math one video at a time. Thanks for joining me today, and I hope you'll come back soon.